Kate Middleton appoints new private secretary amid recovery, and the internet thinks he looks like a sports star. Hello viewers, welcome to Royal Unlock. Please make sure to subscribe and hit the notifications bell, so you don't miss any updates about the British monarchy. The Princess of Wales has been without a private secretary for more than a year. Does Kate Middleton's new right-hand woman look familiar? At the end of February, the Princess of Wales, 42, appointed Lieutenant Colonel Tom Wyatt to lead her staff as private secretary, and the news prompted social media users to point out his resemblance to tennis star Roger Federer. While Princess Kate has not been seen in public for months amid her private recovery following abdominal surgery on January 16, photos of Wyatt have sparked online chatter about the resemblance. ONG he looks like Roger Federer, one commenter wrote on X with a heart emoji, and many users agreed the resemblance was uncanny. Last summer, Princess Kate took to the court with Federer, 42, for a behind-the-scenes tour of the Ball Boys and Girls program at Wimbledon, and the two sat together on court on the second day of the tennis tournament. The Princess of Wales is a patron of the All England Tennis and Croquet Club, and Federer told the New York Times that he enjoyed watching Wimbledon with her. I know her very well, said the tennis legend, who retired from the sport in 2022. She is an avid tennis fan and plays herself. Although White is new to Princess Kate's team, he is very familiar with working for Princess Kate. The royal family, most recently serving as groom to the late Queen Elizabeth. Although the Queen has scaled back her public appearances in her final years amid the COVID-19 pandemic, White was seen alongside her at a modified Trooping the Colour ceremony in the summer of 2021 and again at the Royal Windsor Horse Show. The aide was also on hand to receive former British Prime Minister Boris Johnson at Balmoral Castle on 6 September 2022, as he resigned from his position to pass the role to Liz Truss. The meetings were Queen Elizabeth's last meeting before her death two days later at the age of 96. According to The Telegraph, White joined the Buckingham Palace team in 2020 after serving with the Royal Marines. While serving in Afghanistan in 2009, the soldier, then 22, helped stop a school bombing by the Taliban after wires were discovered under a classroom door before the bombing. The Telegraph reported that White went to Princess Kate's inaugural National Symposium, in London in November and was poised to fill a position that had been vacant for more than a year. The Princess of Wales previously relied on Hannah Coburn Logie as her private secretary from 2020 to 2022, before she left for personal reasons. Coburn Logue replaces Catherine Quinn in the royal role, who was Kate's private secretary from 2017 to 2019. At the time, the Daily Mail reported that the two left things on the best terms. The Telegraph described Princess Kate's idea of appointing White as something of a return to tradition for the family, reflecting the royal family's close ties to the military, and its connection to her husband's late grandmother. Princess Kate isn't the only royal to choose a new leader for her team. At the end of February, her husband, Prince William, appointed Ian Patrick to run his office. Patrick is a former diplomat and worked for the Foreign and Commonwealth Office in International Peacekeeping in Bosnia and Herzegovina. He is also a trustee of the Crohn's and Colitis UK charity. Following these appointments, a CEO will be appointed to head the joint teams of the pair. Recruitment has not been announced yet.